and they're going to burn out because they're going to start to spin their wheels too fast, or what they're going to do is they're going to completely give up and learn helplessness and hopelessness, right? So those are the consequences of fear if we don't really understand how to cope with fear. Now what we want to turn this into is, okay, instead of a fixed mindset that failure means that I can't succeed, we're going to say failure means that I have an opportunity. Now I'm talking all about students today, but I could give you examples of how parents live from these three fears and instill these three fears in their children. So FOLO comes in the event of a tutor, a three-sport athlete, and off-season training, plus the best of this and the best of that. That's <coughs> the great parenting from FOLO. <laughs> They're afraid that if they don't spend as much money as they have and don't give all of their efforts to their child, that it'll be their fault when they lose out on opportunity for their child to succeed. So when you have a FOLO parent, what you have to do is you have to look at why they're doing that, what are their perfectionistic tendencies, what are their fears, and trying to reflect that back on them a little bit just to help them gain, gain some insight that the way that they're parenting can be a parallel to the way that that child is acting. 